Okay folks, so today we're going to talk about how you can maintain balance when solving equations. But before we start to think about solving equations, I feel like we need to step back a little bit and you need to get some experience at working with equations. For some of you, this is still uh, a sticking point. So let's have a look here. We have this rectangle. Tried to draw a square, didn't work. So we're going to work with a rectangle. You already know from your previous grades what the formula is to find the area of a rectangle. And you know how to work with formulas. Formulas are equations, okay? A, we know that represents area. That's what we're trying to find. We're trying to find the area. You know that L stands for length, and you know that W stands for width. So this general formula, this generic system that you use to find the area of this rectangle is something that you're quite experienced with substituting numbers in for those unknown letters, those unknown variables. So if this square had, let's say, um, a perimeter of three centimeters by four centimeters, then you could easily, you already know how to substitute that in, right? We know we would go and then there you go. So that's, you have experience doing that of taking these letters, substituting the actual variables once we know what they are, and then working within the context of the formula to find out what that area is, the variable we actually want to find out what we're looking for. When you're working with algebra, it's much the same thing, okay? So remembering that if I was to give you this as a question, let's take um, x plus 10 equals 17. You are very familiar. If I had to give you a number, if I said x was 7, you could put that in there and we'd be good to go. But what if I said to you, solve for x? What if I said to you, I want you to tell me what x is? I think this is where the stumbling block is for a lot of you. A lot of you are used to algebraic expressions where you work to finding an answer that this sign right here, this equals sign, means find me the answer. That's not what equals means. Equals means that whatever is on one side of the equation is exactly the same. It is equal to, it's balanced with, what's on the other side. The left and the right side of the equation are always the same. I could likewise have said, um, uh, that would also would work, right? because both sides still equal 17. 